Hello and welcome to another Microsoft 365 video. In today's episode, I will explain you how you can create a self-shot in Microsoft Teams to easily take notes, write quick message, or even store files and images. The self-shot feature is actually planned to be released in June 2022, as you can see in this roadmap announcement, but while it does not get available, I will explain you a workaround so you can take advantage of this mechanism to store your messages or your files while using Microsoft Teams on your computer or on your mobile phone. To create a chat with yourself, the first thing you have to do is click in the calendar. Once in the calendar and at the top of the window, you must click in the Meet Now button. Provide a name for the meeting and this one will be the name of your personal chat in Microsoft Teams. So in this case, my personal chat will be called me. Once it's done, click in the Start Meeting and wait for the pre-join screen to show up. In this section, you can pretty much ignore the settings that will appear as you will not use the meeting to actually have a conversation with somebody else. So let's click join. Once you've joined the meeting, ignore the pop-up to invite others to join you and close it. The next step will be to click in the chat and write a message to yourself. This will make the chat for the meeting to appear in the chat tab once you end up the meeting. So let's type here a quick message. And now that everything is configured, let's click in the leave button to end up the meeting. And again, back to Microsoft Teams, let's go to chat. And in the recent chats, you will see that there is a meeting with the name that you previously gave to your self chat. To take advantage of this, I suggest you to pin this chat so you will always have access to it at the top of your chats. So to do that, you have to click in these three dots, go to pin. And now if you want to, you can also move it all the way to the top. From this moment on, you will be able to type whatever you want in this meeting chat and you will also be able to add files to the chat so you can keep track of your notes or of your files so you don't forget while you are using Microsoft Teams things that you don't have any other place to write. Hope you like this video. If you want to get more videos like this, make sure you click the subscription button down below. Bye bye.